morning, everyone, and thank you for joining us at the Extraordinary Women Holistic Network. I'm Daniel Kutsia, the chapter leader and owner of Evolve Harmoniously. And this morning, we had the privilege of welcoming Layla Walters from Elevate Life, talking to us about how to get your soul back into the driver's seat. Thank you very much, Layla. Oh, thank you for having me. <laughs> it was such an amazing morning being able to get so much tools that we can use to actually can I say communicate or talk to our soul um, and being able to use that in our day-to-day -day life. If you can maybe share some insight with our viewers and listeners of what they can do to really connect back to their soul and put them in the driver's seat. Wonderful. So a lot of people don't realize that their soul is a direct connection to the creator of all that is. And even though connecting with angels and spirit guides can help you get guidance in your life, it is vitally important to be able to connect first and foremost with your own soul to get direct connection and guidance. A lot of people don't know this because we're not taught that. And I am here to help people connect with their soul so that they can get that guidance. So one asks, how do you connect more with your soul? And why is your body driving in the first place? And that's because of conditioning. So first and foremost, we need to remind the body that it's done an amazing job, but your body's only taken you as far as it can. And by surrendering to your soul and only your soul, you can then get your soul back in the driver's seat to then guide you along this amazing soul plan that your soul has for you. Getting that guidance is so important because the body tends to freak out and want to plan things, which is understandable. Not true. We, we have this uh, desire to make known the unknown and we want to have guarantees. And when the body is freaking out, that for you is a big sign that it's time for you to connect with your soul. So mirror work is very, very important for that. And I encourage you to do mirror work quite regularly, looking in the mirror and actually pointing to yourself and saying, hi body, I see you, hey soul, and actually saying, we do this together, will allow your body to feel so much more relaxed knowing that big brother or big sister is actually behind <laughs> the wheel now, and that you don't have to do this by yourself. And more importantly, you need to ask your soul, okay, what is the next step? What do I need to do? Because your soul's not gonna give you all the different steps uh, on your path. Yeah. Uh, it's only going to give you the next step because let's face it your body is going to want to get involved and probably <laughs> mess up the plan a bit so you need to be available and just keep asking what's the very next step who do i need to reach out to now and then just trust that your soul has your best interest at heart absolutely and i think that's the most important part is being able to know that <coughs> the true connection and the true person that you actually need to be dealing with is yourself and the true yes. part of who you are so thank you very much everybody for joining us this morning and you can make contact with Layla with the contact details at the end of this video clip. Enjoy the rest of the day. Bye-bye.